Hi everybody, we are over here at 2761 Pine Street, over at Divisadero, which is over to my left, and Broderick, Rafi says hello, and we're going to look at this beautiful 3500 square foot house, um, which is with Declan and Molly, or Molly Poe and Declan Hickey over at Compass now. I love this house. Designed by Chris Maniello, one of our favorite designers and stagers, you're going to notice a lot of great design details here that are very different. It's kind of that transitional, hipster, yet fun, beautiful house. First, you're going to notice that they use Suntec hardware, the champagne bronze is really cool. You've got smart house integration um, as well, I think. Beautiful wallpaper, I love these fixtures. And I love the finish on this, um, on the walls. It's kind of that millwork detail, but it's not ostentatious, but it's just really refined. So in here, I love these two big oversized fixtures here. You've got this beautiful fireplace. Even though you're in Pine Street, it's very quiet. As you can see, very nice double pane windows that are really, that really cut down the noise as well. Beautiful gas fireplace. And over here, you can kind of see the sweep of the property. It's really beautiful. Uh, 3,500 square feet, almost 3,600 square feet. Um, I think there are four baths and six, no, no, four beds and six baths or something. Um, take a look. Beautiful. I love the in wall or in mirror detail. Again, the beautiful marble fixtures as well and the uh, in wall uh, profile there. Um, you're going to see some beautiful details here, but let's take a look at the kitchen and the open living area. Here's our happy listing agent, Molly. And ah, look at this beautiful island here. I love this just comfortable sitting area as well. It's warm, it's inviting. Lots of windows you can open up and let some uh, air in or whatnot. Uh, there's a beautiful outdoor area downstairs, which we'll see in a, in a little bit. And um, you go so far back into the lot here, and you have a great location. You're at the tip of Nopa and the tip of, I guess, Lower Pacific Heights and whatnot. But one of the details that I really like is the cabinetry and the hardware that you've done. The hardware is from Buster and Punch. It's a company from London. They originally made motorcycles, and now they make they make this beautiful hardware too. It's so substantial and it's nice. Look at the cabinetry here, the marble. I love the tile, and it's just really sophisticated. A great color palette that's both smart and contemporary. Beautiful six burner thermidor plus the grill. You've got the two ovens as well, the microwave, and just super tall ceilings. There's sound, beautiful light fixtures as you can see, and just. A great sense of space and notice how quiet it is so we're going to go upstairs now i love the simple sort of shaker interpretation that's also really simple as well and yet very elegant i really do quite like these light fixtures chris has done a great job helping them style the home beautiful wood floors here and you have three rooms on this floor all of them en suite the first and most dramatic is this Look at that, the beadboard and the ceiling, but you've got this beautiful bathroom. Look how wide and spacious it is. this is. That the marble marble trough, basically. And you've got the beadboard or the ship flap going up. I love the indirect lighting. You have here, your private facility is in here. Again, love the uh, finishes. It's the brass, brass is back, but it's done in a different way. You've got a great cloth wood tub here. And then you've also got this great walk-in shower with a low lip entry. And I love this. You've got an outdoor shower. And you've got this beautiful living wall as well. Because it is a really nice and warm day today. It's March and it's 70. So welcome to San Francisco. Master bedroom continued. Look at all this. In absence of a sort of closet which you never see, you've got these beautiful, nice, tall cabinets, wardrobes. And you've got the uh, reproduction of the of a timber ceiling. Beautiful view out here. You can see Deviz is off in the distance. And more of, um, yeah, let me just look, you'll see down in a second. Great neighbors, pretty quiet as well. You've got this green belt orientation here. Um, let's go back inside. Again, really super tall ceilings. And proceeding along, gosh, it's just a great sense of air. Uh, in here. I love these fixtures. Skylight up there. Here's the second bedroom, which is really nice as well. And you've got a ensuite as well. I love, this is great, the herringbone, but look at this texture. 
it's really just nice and soft. Again, it's all the little details that count. I love this uh, standalone fixture too. And over here, linen closet. Oh, sorry, no, washer dryer. Conveniently located to where the bedrooms are. And then there's this bedroom here. That's the amount of street noise that you hear. Again, with the beautiful built-ins. And look at this bathroom here. Clever. I love the use of that. Oh, wow. Take a look at that shower or tub, but this tile is really bold. It's great. It's a mirror tile, but it's really cool. Coming over here, again, the the, the, the trusses in the ceiling, the sense of scale, I mean, this might be a smaller or smaller room depth-wise, but it's really tall and it makes up for that. Again, here's a close-up of the detailing on the doors. I mean, just really smart. Now, if you like all that, just wait till you see the down downstairs. So we'll go down. Love this sense of space. Like that light going up from there. Going down. Now, this is interesting. You've got, I think it's about two car garage parking, if not more. You could probably wedge in something extra. But you're like, oh, it's a dark. What's down here? So you open it up, and you have two doors. One that way, and one this way. Well, this one is towards something completely surprising. Welcome to your master suite. Well, I guess master suite, or maybe in wall, or maybe an income unit, maybe your man cave or whatnot, too. Here's that outdoor space I was talking about. I love the stonework. Take a look here. Outdoor fireplace. I really, really quite like this color. It's a great platinum, the stone, the uh, barbecue, and then, you know, there's the upstairs. Remember, we've been coming up and down, and we've come all the way down to the bottom floor. So much storage down here. You also, pardon me, have a full cooking area. You've got your refrigerator as well, the Liebherr, counter depth, the Bosch, and then you've got this great, let me see if I can this on, the light cooking area well here. So definitely convenient, definitely perfect for the in-law. Uh, and if you're looking for an in-law, aha, here is the in-law part. I love that picture. I think it's from Rejuvenation, and then take a look. The interpretation of this room is that it's dark, so go dark. But it's not so dark that, again, this interpretation of the herringbone on the wall, the softness, and then here you've got the trough again, but then a darker stone, same light picture detailing, great millwork, and yeah. So, we're almost done. Uh, I really like it. You know, it's different, more closet here. It's smart and it's bright, and there is value here because you get so much by way of square footage. Another you actually have a bath or even like a down step here. Again, the thought behind the detailing is really, I think, pretty nice. And go along here, that aspect to upstairs. This is your garage. So you do have internal access. And then here. Yeah, I guess you could do two car tandem, or one car definitely. And then you've got all the mechanicals. You've got two boilers. Um, you have a passive water tank, you've got the raging heat manifolds, I think it's probably one for one for each level. Um, boiler and boiler for a hot water supply and then also for your heating. And over here, oh yeah, you've got two water supplies coming in too, so, or branches off into two. So, yeah, 30 meters. So maybe it is, maybe there is a potential to do some sort of uh, two unit type of thing. You never know. And you've got the little storage here. And to start where we went from, we're back out here. And we're exactly back to where we started at. Well, pretty much. So, Pine Street here, with, this is with Molly and with Declan, 2761 Pine, 4995. It's a great property. Um, if there are any questions, let me know about it. Of course, I'm Kevin Ho from Vanguard Properties. So, without further ado, thanks for watching.